Hello everyone! So for today, we're going to cook flavor-rich beef rendang. So this one is an Indonesian dish and we will be using products from Carmen Foods. So first is the SNB Layu Chili Oil and then we also have here Thai Kyung Chili Powder. You can find these ingredients in Carmen Foods just visit www.carmanfoods.com. Carmen Foods is the number one curated Asian food grocer. It is also the ultimate place for your Asian needs. We can provide Asian ethnic food ingredients and deliver it to your doorstep. We have Korean, Chinese, Japanese, and Southeast Asian ingredients. So let's prepare and cook the flavor-rich beef rendang. For the complete ingredients, first, for the spice paste, we have here one half onion, quartered and peeled, three garlic cloves, peeled, and two fresh red chilies, four stalks of lemongrass, so we used only the white part, chopped, 1.5 inch fresh ginger, peeled, that's for the spice paste and we can add additional 2 tablespoons of water if needed. We also have 1 tablespoon of olive oil, 1 cinnamon stick and 1 star anise, 1.5 pound of beef. So I also added some beef parts with bones for extra flavor. So this one is cut into 2 inch cubes, 1 cup coconut cream, this is tamarind water, so this one is 2 cups, but we will only add more if needed. 1 4 teaspoon of turmeric powder. Our first main ingredient, 1 tablespoon of SNB Layu Chili Oil. 1 teaspoon of Thai Kim Chili Powder, another main ingredient we can buy in Carmen Foods. 1 half teaspoon of cumin seed powder. 2 teaspoon of brown sugar. 1 half cup of desiccated coconut toasted, so I just toast it over medium heat. And for the toppings, we have here coriander leaves. So let's make the spice paste now. Onions, garlic cloves and fresh red chilies, fresh lemon grass, and ginger. So let's process it. Let's process it now. Let's check it. We can add 2 tablespoons of water. And then we can process it again. So we will process it again. This is okay already. We just need to set it aside. Okay, we need the sauce pot. And now we're gonna heat the sauce pot over medium to high heat. Once the sauce pot is hot, let's add the olive oil. Swirl the pot to spread the oil. Now let's add and fry the cinnamon stick and star anise. Okay, let's fry it for a minute until it's fragrant. Once it's very fragrant, we now remove it. After removing it, we can now add and saute the beef. So let's fry each side. So 
So I added some beef with bones for more flavor. But it's also okay to just add beef meat. And now, let's add the spice mixture. So here it is. Now, let's stir it so that the spice mixture will be evenly distributed to the beef. Now, we're going to add the coconut cream and the tamarind water or the tamarind soup. Now, let's mix it. Now, let's add the spices. First is SNB Lyo Chili Oil. And then, turmeric powder. Cumin seed powder. Another ingredient from Carmen Foods, Thai Kim Chili Powder. Sugar. Now, let's mix it. We can now cover this and let it cook for around 30 minutes or until the beef is cooked through. So let's check. It's already 30 minutes and we have to stir it occasionally so that the flavors will be fully absorbed and will caramelize perfectly. So, a few trivia about beef rendang. So, beef rendang means a rich and tender coconut beef stew, which is flavor rich. As you can see, the sauce is really flavor rich and, and it smells really good. It's a famous Indonesian beef dish, rich in flavors, fragrant aroma, and as a matter of fact, it's voted twice as number one dish by CNN's World 50 Best Foods last 2011 and 2017. I'm really excited to taste this. But for now, we have to simmer it longer since the beef is still not tender. So we have to cover it again. Well, after one and a half hours, we can uncover it now and check the beef. If it's tender already. And also we can stir it so that it prevents sticking to the pot. Yeah, I think it's already tender. So we can now add the desiccated coconut that we toasted. And let's mix it now. Let's make sure that it is well combined. And allow it to cook. By the way, I added around one and a half cups of water. Or you can add the tamarind water if you have that. So let's allow it to cook more. We can now remove it from the heat and top it with fresh coriander. We can serve this with rice. So here's our flavor-rich beef rendang. So this recipe is good for two to three serves. And we use ingredients from Carmen Foods. First is the SNB Layu Chili Oil, and we also use the Thai Kim Chili Powder. So now we're going to try this one. But first, take note that you can buy the ingredients from Carmen Foods. Just visit www.carmenfoods.com. Our selection are constantly growing, and if you have any suggestions, please contact us at our website. So happy eating!